The City of Topeka created a series of videos to educate local property owners and property landscape and maintenance staff on how to manage the Stormwater Best Management Practices, or BMPs, located on the property they own or maintain. This is the first video in the series. It will teach you about stormwater, specifically what it is and how it is managed. Throughout the video series, we will be referring to the City of Topeka Owner's Guide to BMP Maintenance, which can be seen here. You can find it on the City of Topeka Utilities website at the web address provided here. Hi folks, my name is Aaron Grams. I'm the Stormwater Permit Coordinator for the City of Topeka in the Utilities Department. I'm here today to present you with an introduction to the Stormwater Post-Construction Best Management Practice Maintenance Items and also some other common items that you can come across during your inspection. But first, let's discuss what is stormwater. Stormwater is any precipitation that falls from the sky. That can be the forms of rain, sleet, snow, or hail. When there is enough precipitation that does not evaporate or soak into the ground, it will collect and run off into storm drains, streams, and rivers. As it travels, it collects pollutants such as sediment, fertilizers, oil, and chemicals. These pollutants can damage water quality, which can harm aquatic life and vegetation. In a natural landscape with no development, stormwater is absorbed into the ground, which is referred to as pervious area, or falls into bodies of water. In an urban landscape, the stormwater falls onto impervious areas such as parking lots, driveways, rooftops, and roads. When this happens, the stormwater cannot soak into the ground. The Clean Water Act was enacted in 1972 to restore and maintain clean and healthy waters. It was a response to increasing public concern for the environment and for the condition of the nation's waters. This federal act established the National Pollutant Discharge Elimination System, or NPDES, which the City of Topeka is required to implement a stormwater management program. Stormwater issues can be caused by the loss of natural landscape and the increase of roads and buildings on developed land. That is why stormwater best management practices, also known as BMPs, are a necessary part of any property with large impervious surfaces. Some properties have more than one BMP to address all of the stormwater issues. BMPs are designed and engineered to prevent or reduce the negative impacts of stormwater related flooding, erosion, and pollution by retaining or detaining stormwater. BMPs can serve multiple purposes. Apart from stormwater management, some types of BMPs provide aesthetic landscaping, functional space, or planned green space. Starting January 1, 2021, a stormwater BMP operation and maintenance plan is also required for the property. This agreement includes a map of the property showing the locations, boundaries, and proper classifications of all the BMPs on the property. There are four main categories of BMPs to prevent issues with stormwater runoff. Retention BMPs prevent flooding, erosion, and pollution by capturing and storing stormwater permanently. Depending on the design, retention BMPs can either have a permanent pool of water or be dry when not in use. Detention BMPs are often referred to as detention pond or detention basin. These types of BMPs prevent flooding and soil erosion by temporarily storing stormwater then releasing it slowly and safely during and after the rainfall. Some are designed to detain the water for 24 to 48 hours to allow pollutants to either settle to the bottom or filter through vegetation that lines the bottom of the BMP before the water is released. Like retention BMPs, detention BMPs can have a permanent pool of water or be dry when not in use. Green infrastructure BMPs are a special type of BMP designed to manage pollution and stormwater. These are designed to mimic how a natural landscape full of leafy vegetation and loose soil manages stormwater. Most allow water to soak into the ground and filter through special loose soil to remove pollutants. Depending on the design, the filtered water is either dispersed into the surrounding soil or is collected in an underdrain located near the bottom of the BMP and carried off the property. Many green BMPs are difficult to spot as they look like managed landscaped areas. Manufactured BMPs are designed to remove pollutants from stormwater by filter or mechanical means before the water is released. These BMPs are typically located underground, near or in a stormwater inlet, or under a manhole cover. While manufactured BMPs are out of sight, they require significantly more maintenance than the other types of BMPs. As mentioned before, BMPs are constructed in a wide variety of sizes, shapes, and styles. Clearly, BMPs are important to keeping Topeka's local waterways clean. 
Because they discharge clean water to Topeka's public drainage system, they are also important to extending the life of that system and reducing the need for system maintenance and repairs. But to work properly, BMPs must be routinely maintained so they always function the way they were designed. The city of Topeka does not maintain private drainage systems. This includes BMPs located on private property. Instead, private property owners have the responsibility to keep the BMPs located on their property maintained and fully functioning. Watch the next video titled, Know Your Stormwater BMP Responsibilities, to find out more such as how to locate a BMP on your property, what your responsibilities are, and how you can contribute to keeping Topeka's waterways clean for generations to come.